Oh, uh, oh. Mother of Irene. I had no idea Koei-chan could cause so much pain. Let's just give up, Lawrence. The further we dig for information, the more we dig ourselves into trouble. We can't give up that easily. There has to be another way. Garth? What? Look! <gasps> oh. They're just going into a cake shop. For what? A uh, cake? Who buys cakes together? Couples do. <sighs> Lawrence, now you're overreacting. She already said she just wanted to be friends with Aaron. We have to respect that. Fine, but just to make sure, maybe we could take one peep. <gasps> Look at all the cakes! <gasps> Aaron, there's so many! Look at this! Oh, there's chocolate cake. Uh, what is this? Carrot cake? Oh, strawberry cake? More chocolate cake? There's just so many to choose from! Pardon me for asking, but why did you want to stop in here exactly? Oh, um, <laughs> I wanted to buy a cake. Uh... After Kawai-chan said she was making a cake, I got the urge and kind of figured it would be a nice gesture to bring one for everyone at the dinner tonight. Especially for Garth and Lawrence, since they've been so great at respecting my privacy so far. It's kind of my way of saying to everyone, thank you guys for being my friends. And I want it to be a surprise too, in a way. So, <laughs> yeah. Why don't we just buy a cake at the restaurant we go to? Uh... Because that's way too complicated, obviously. <laughs> I mean, I know it would be even more personal if I made the cake myself, but at the moment, we don't really have time, and I feel like bringing a cake, um, as opposed to getting it right there at the restaurant, is a little bit more personal. I don't know. I guess it's just my own preference. <laughs> Fair enough. So what kind are you going to get? Uh... <laughs> you know what? I'm not sure. I didn't think too far into... Yeah, I didn't think too far. I just It was just a spur of the moment kind of thing. Well, why not ask to try a few samples? He motions to the baker. Excuse me, miss. My friend and I here would like to try a few samples of the cakes. Uh, Aaron! What? You said you weren't sure. Plus, it's free cake. <laughs> fine, fine. We can try the cakes. Uh, I, I don't even know where to get them. Let me ask her. Hold on one second. Um, excuse me, miss. Oh! You and your handsome friend here can try some of the samples in the fridge unit over there. Help yourselves. Also, you should give me your recipe for that hunk of man cake you got with you. Look at those abs! She motions towards air. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, is this the fridge? Uh, yeah! Uh, yeah, it looks like it's the fridge. Um, let's see, it says sample one unit. Okay. Uh, one unit, one sample per person in this unit. Okay, yeah, that's perfectly fine. Um, hmm. She kind of mentioned, okay, so I guess we could try as many samples as we like of one, right? I'm not entirely sure. Well, let's try some. What's your favorite kind of cake? <laughs> um, let's see, my favorite kind of cake? Well, personally, I like red abs. Uh, velvet! Uh, <laughs> velvet, I like red velvet cake. Yes, uh, <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna, uh, this is crab cake, just, I just, I'm just gonna try one, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try the, yeah, I'm gonna try the red velvet cake here, there we go, <laughs> alright, let's see, how does this, um, uh, 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 are you okay? This one tastes better, what? Really? Uh, Aaron, Aaron, you got some frosting on your face. It's right- no, it's right there. There. Did I get it? <laughs> no, here. Let me help you. You'll see. They're just shopping. Take a look. Ah! Mm, there you go. I got it. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, I think we should tell the baker about this. I mean, these- I even just- mine is really bad. Come on, let's go tell her. Uh, excuse me, uh, ma'am? Um, I'm sorry to bother you, but these cakes that were in the sample fridge, they're really bitter. Ugh, not again. Ugh. Michi, get your butt out here! Huh? Uh, yeah, yes, sir? 
Uh, these sweets are bitter again. Yeah, that's not my problem. Uh, not your problem? You put on your resume you can make amazing sweets. This is the third time, Michi. The last couple of times your sweets knocked out a customer cold. You're fired. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, whatever. Michi didn't need this lame job anyway. Yeah, good luck finding someone better than me for this stupid dumb shop of yours. Michi out. <laughs> I have an idea. Follow her. B uh, but Lawrence, she's a cat people. We have no choice. Let's go. So sorry about that. Here, you can have this cake I made myself. I'm gonna have to remake a lot of the cakes on display, so this one is on the house for hurting your friend's handsome taste buds. Here you go. Oh, gee, thanks. <laughs> I am so glad you care about me, too. Thanks, my taste buds are fine. Oh, so where to now? Um, hmm, it's almost time for dinner, so I really should message everyone the place we're going to. Hmm, let's see. Where are we going? Ah, well, <laughs> see, I was planning on taking everyone to Olive Garden. <laughs> what do you think? Should we? I'm fine with that. <laughs> Alright, great. I'll text everyone to meet us there. Okay? Alright, let's go. I'll text, you walk. Go, go. I'm so glad everyone could make it. Uh, Garth? Lawrence? Are you guys okay? Um, you guys look a little... Um, distraught, I guess? Everything is perfectly fine. Absolutely nothing wrong. We're 100%. Just a few cat scratches from cats. We, the cats from earlier. Yes, those. Okay. Uh, uh Kawaii-chan, why are you staring at them then? It's... Is everything okay? Kawaii-chan is perfectly fine, as long as Afmao Senpai and Eren Kun are sitting close together. <laughs> uh, oh. Kawaii-chan, I would appreciate it if you didn't take any more pictures of me and Eren, or put any pictures of me and Eren together. But, 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 but fine. Kawaii-chan won't take any more pictures of you guys secretly ever again. She promises. Huh, <sighs> okay. Um, <clears throat> uh, good! Kawaii-chan will ask before she takes them. Don't worry, Afmao senpai uh, uh, nah, that's... That's not exactly what I meant, Kawaii-chan. Um, uh, uh, yeah, I feel the exact same way, Aaron. I, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Caitlin! I don't see why you're allowing her to do that shipping thing to you. If it were me, I'd punch her. She tried to ship me with Lawrence. Can you believe that? The nerve of her. Not only that, she tried to ship poor Nicole with Dante. Uh... Well, Caitlin, you know... <laughs> I mean, she seems happy when she does this kind of thing, and who am I to tell her what... I mean, yeah, it's an invasion of privacy, and she's making assumptions and trying to push me with somebody I am not... Yeah, but I mean... <laughs> what? Why just not let her? Let her have her little fantasies and stuff. I swear, if you ever start doing that kind of stuff, I will make you wish you didn't. Uh. <laughs> You're no fun, Caitlin. Meh. I heard what Caitlin told you. Ugh. That was not cool. Koichan chan is super weird. I mean, who the heck would even like Dante? He's an ignorant jerk who trains in a very cute way. Anyway, she's dumb if she thinks I'm ever gonna be with him. Why doesn't she just ship herself with him if she likes the idea of shipping so much? You'd never catch me with Dante ever, not even in 15 years or ever. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, what? I'm gonna excuse myself for a moment. Uh, are, are you leaving, Aaron? I, um, <sighs> sorry. Oh, bathroom. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, that sounded a little... 
Ugh, okay, all right, I'm gonna sit down. Anyway. You guys go. He's out cold, and here are his clothes, as requested. Uh, minus the boxers. Now, pay me my diamonds. Hey, I thought you said if he was cute, you'd do this for free. The strong, silent type aren't Michi's type at all. Yeah, He's handsome, I'll give him that, but he's not someone Michi would want to try to make her boyfriend. So pay me. <sighs> Fine, here. Yeah, Michi out! Here, Garth, put these on. M me Why me? You're closer to Erin in personality. If it's me, she'll know. All you have to do is talk to her and find out her address. Now come on, let's get to work. Ah, Erin! Welcome back. The waiter just took our drink orders, and I just got you, Garth, and Lawrence some water since you guys weren't here. Um, I'm assuming they went to the bathroom as well. They were kind of in a hurry, it seemed. Um, hmm. Speaking of which, where's Garth? He, uh, really had to go to the bathroom. Uh, bad. He'll be in there for a bit. I should probably go check on him in a little while. In the meantime, uh, where did you say you were moving to again? I farted so hard in the bathroom, I forgot. But because I do that, it's so disgusting. You probably don't want to date a guy like that. Uh, what the? That doesn't sound like something Aaron would do. <gasps> oh no, they didn't. Oh, they did not. Oh, they did. Oh, okay. All right. You know what? <laughs> Fine. If they want to play that game, then I can too. <laughs> I've always liked that about you. What? Uh, I mean, yeah. No. Aaron, darling, I wanted to talk to you about what happened while we were packing earlier. Oh. I'm just glad we got Garth and Lawrence off our backs. That gave us enough time to be alone together. You guys didn't... Uh, I mean, yeah, I am too glad. We talked about feelings. <laughs> we sure gave him the slip though, right? Oh, and at the bake shop, I just wanted to say that you were right. Red velvet would be a wonderful choice for our wedding cake. I knew you and Aaron were something. I knew it was you, Garth. Oh, crud. Um, uh, if you guys are done, can I have my shirt back? Oh, great! This day couldn't get any better, could it? I had to ask.